Welcome to my YouTube automotive channel. In today's video I have a 2014 Ford Taurus and I will show you how to update the Ford Sync. Now luckily you don't have to take the vehicle to a Ford dealer and spend any money. You can just download the software uh, from the Ford website and do the installation by yourself. Everything you will need is a small USB stick. Okay, now I will continue this video by recording the screen on my, my computer. So you want to go to Ford.com support sync maps updates and you want to enter your vehicle serial number or the VIN number right here and then click check for updates. And in my case, as you can see, sync update is available. Now on the right side, you can see here my current version, generation sync 2, sync version 3.5, and there is update available. Uh, yeah. So here you can select if you wanna to go to a dealer, but that will cost you money or you can do it on the USB drive by yourself. So you select USB drive. Okay, and here it says what you need, depending on the which uh, version of sync you have. But if you get like 32 gigabytes uh, USB drive, that should be enough. Okay, one more thing I will mention. So you want to format your uh, USB before you do this. Um, if you have a SYNC 2, you want to format it as uh, FAT32. But if you have the newest Ford, uh, then you want to do it at XFAT. So if you have SYNC 3 or newer, but older than SYNC 3. So SYNC 2 will be this one and just format it, right? Next thing you will do, just press download update. And the download should start. Okay, once this file has been downloaded, I have it on my desktop. You wanna press the right mouse button and select open with and select the file explorer and press okay. And what you will do now, you will select all these files, right click, select copy, and then select your USB drive, right click and select uh, paste. And now you wait, so all these copies to the USB drive. Okay, now once those files have been copied, you take your USB back to the car you can start your vehicle and then you can plug in that USB to the USB port. Now I have a Ford Taurus so my port is right here. And as soon as you plug it in you will see this installation screen on the Please keep your vehicle running, dashboard. not accessory mode throughout the entire installation. If you choose to upgrade your vehicle while idling in your driveway, make sure your vehicle is not in an enclosed space such as a garage during this time. Additionally, always make sure airflow under the vehicle is not blocked by tall grass, snow or any other obstruction. Okay, so the idea is the car has to be running while this installation is happening. Okay, so I'll press OK. And now I have to wait. This might take up to half hour. I'm doing this for the first time as well, so honestly I have no idea how long it will take. But I will continue recording once uh, this is done, I guess. Okay, so this goes very slow. I'm like 10 or 15 minutes into the update and it's at 8%. Okay, I think it's almost done. It came to 100% and now the screen reset. And yeah. Please 
Please do not remove your USB device until after you press OK on the final installation complete okay, message after this message. Then take your USB device and return to your Sync owner account at www.syncmyride.com slash support to confirm you have updated your software successfully. And once I press OK, that should be it. Installation completed. And now in the end, if you want to report uh, your update to Ford, that way they can let you know if new updates uh, show up. You go back on your computer, uh, confirm update, browse for log file. You want to select the USB. Then you want to select uh, sync my right. You want to go all the way down and select this file right here and press open. And that's it. And now here you will see if you enter your VIN number again, sync is up to date. Thank you for watching this video. I hope it was helpful and educational. If it was, please like it and consider subscribing to my YouTube automotive channel. On my channel, there is lots of how-to videos, do-it-yourself videos, car reviews, product reviews, and other similar automotive topics.